uh, hey guys, uh, uh, this is Prasanna here from India. Uh, there's a lot of confusion like how exactly uh, to get to know the logs of uh, or crash logs for iPad or iPhones, right? You you get confused and you try to install a lot of other tools and things like that. The simple way to get iPhones or iPad crash logs uh, uh, is this, right? So now what you do is you connect your iPhones, you ensure that you have iTunes installed on your system. I have your iTunes installed, right? Once you install the iTunes, you connect your iPhone or iPad and perform some action and you know, let's assume that a crash happens in one of the apps. Now, what you do is you go to iTunes to connect your device. Now I've connected my device here. You can see my uh, device which got connected. Now click on it. Now you see everything here. Now there's a tab called sync, right? Click on it. Now what happens is your computer syncs your iPhone and all the diagnostic information gets copied to your system, right? Now once you are copied, now open your Windows Explorer. Now let me start here. Go to C. Now you can see all these folders. Click on user folder. Click on the logged in user. In my case, it is my press B is my folder who is logged in. Click on it. You see here app data, right? This typically this folder will not get shown unless you have your hidden items checked in your windows now look at this so what you do is go here click on hidden items you see app data click on app data you see three folders go to roaming you see apple computer folder click on apple computer there are multiple folders here now click on logs now you here you go crash reporter device link everything now go to crash reporter Assume that this is a crash, so you need to go to crash reporter, click on mobile device. Since I've connected my iPhone on uh, i2 on, on my system, you see uh, this, this phone folder getting created automatically. Go to here, you see this, right? Lot of documents or files. Now go to type. If you want to find a crash file, look at this, the type of the crash file. So there are crash files that crash happen in you know, a lot of my apps. So if you look at this is one of the examples of crash file that you can find on uh, which crashed on iPhone. So you can pick this file and use wherever you want. So that that's it about for today. Hope you enjoyed this video and it's pretty clear and uh, you can easily use this video to get the uh, files, uh, crash files uh, you need. Thanks. Please subscribe uh, my channel if you like my video and please don't forget to like it. Thanks a lot. I'll keep you posted for some more videos.